All right, I think we're live for Fan Mail Friday on this Friday. We have a few packages to open, including some gigantic boxes, six giant boxes. It took me six trips back and forth to bring all these in here from the post office. In fact, uh, I had to use a dolly to get them out of the post office and into my, my car. These are from Don Barry out in California, and we will be opening these up very shortly. It's going to be kind of a short Fan Mail Friday because I was only able to go to the post office once this week with um, all the games at PNC Park and stuff. So I only went on Tuesday, and I picked up some mail. Looks like we have one, two, three, four um, envelopes, and then all these six giant boxes. Hey, Florencio, how's it going? So um, I just decided to do this live stream style. Olivia is still awake. Say hi, Olivia. Jasper, shout out for your dad. Thanks for watching. Let's start this off with Chris's package here. Chris Petkins. I'm just going to uh, open it off camera real quick just in case there's a note um, with an address or anything in there. <laughs> KB Cards, that's a shout out from you, Olivia. All right, let's see what we got here. It looks like this was actually sent in March and it fell in between the seats of my car, which sometimes happens. I usually just get the mail and put it on my front seat and then I just kind of let it pile up there all week long and bring it on Friday. All right, let's check out this note first. Thank you very much, Larry. It says, I've been watching your channel about a month now and we have a dollar super chat from Donnie Moore. Thank you very much, Donnie. And I thoroughly enjoy your antique shop videos. My father and I have been collecting cards since I was young, and I want to continue the tradition with my son. Growing up in Chicago during the 90s is when I found my love for baseball, especially the Sosa McGuire home run race of 98. I remember the city of Chicago electrify with intensity when Sosa took the lead. That was, uh, that was an awesome summer. I remember reading the box scores every single morning when I would wake up and eat my cereal. Also, remember Griffey making a run at it as well. Who was your favorite to win it? I always liked McGuire. Um, anyways, I have enclosed some cards for you to have. It's nothing much, but I figured you might like it as they are some oddball cards. And he says you should plan on attending a Texas Rangers game this year. It's the last season of Globe Life Park. The new ballpark opens next year. I do hope to go down there sometime this year, maybe. I, I've been there before, so it's not like a, a must go to. Shout out to you, the card base hit. All right, so we have some autographs here. George Foster, that's a good one. George Foster was a, a power hitter from the the um, Reds championship teams of the 70s. He had over 50 home runs one year. Rick Sutcliffe is a nice one. Mark Burley. Uh, Harold Baines, Hall of Famer, Har Harold Baines. That's a very nice one. Uh, and Carlos Lee, El Caballo. Really cool. And then we have rookie cards here. Ichiro Suzuki rookie card. I needed this one. Thank you very much. Unfortunately, it looks like it's uh, one of those um, famous 2001 um, sticky packs where they all stick together because you can see it has some paper loss, but still really cool. I don't have this card, and now I do. Uh, the only card I had, I think, was um, a reprint that you know how Toss does those rookie history cards and stuff. We also have a CC Sabathia rookie card. He's on there with Barry Zito. That's a nice one. And then we have a couple. Adam Eaton was a pretty good one. Adam Wainwright rookie card. He's still pitching. He pitched against the Buckos on opening day at PNC Park. Josh Hamilton. And then we have Jake Peavy and Tina Martinez. So thank you for those rookie cards. I love my rookies. And we have some former Pirates here. Let's check these out. Oh, this is a really old one. 1934 Gaudi. Tony Piet. I have, don't have very many of these cars at all. I think I have like one of them that somebody sent me a while ago. That's from 1934. Libby, this was long before even Pappy was born. This card was made. 1934. Really, really awesome. Thank you, Kerbo. And then we have Willie Stargell Kmart. Uh, we got a Mike Easler, Willie Stargell, Dave Parker, and Burt Blylevin. So thank you for those cards. That one's really awesome. I do love the older cards. I uh, don't have hardly any of these at all. So really, really cool. Really appreciate that first package on Fan Mail Friday. Thank you so much, Chris. Daddy, you on the TV, okay, just make sure you don't have sound on or else there'll be feedback. <laughs> all right, so that's the first one. Libby said she's going to watch us on TV over there. Yeah, I remember that, Pie. 
that spammer guy fire something cards or whatever 20 percent off here's our next one it's um oh i guess there's no the address is actually on the back this is from elliot thomas it says open on camera please let's check it out all right inside we have some cards and a note let me just open the note up real quick and make sure there's no address on there um, looks like there is an address on there, so good thing that uh, I'm not showing that. I'll fold that back. This says, hi, I'm 12. My name is Elliot Thomas. I've collected for months. You are my favorite YouTuber. Can I get a Barry Bonds rookie card and some packs and an auto card? Sign here, please. Really cool. Um, I do have on 87 Tops cards that I can send your way. And uh, let's see what we got here, guys. Looks like it's a nice little um, package of, are these top loaded? Yes, top loaded cards. Not sure when they're from. Looks like they're pretty recent. 2018 Aussie Albies rookie cards on the top with a Roberto Clemente uh, Diamond Kings card. Um, we have a Don Manley Diamond Kings. By the way, Diamond Kings is coming out next Wednesday and I bought a master case. That's 24 boxes of it. And I bought it from a dealer in California who's going to have it drop shipped to me. And uh, so I'll have it on release day. So we'll be opening up the brand new release of Diamond Kings next week. And then we have a Justin Verlander opening day 2010 card. Really cool. Thank you very much for those cards, Elliot. Appreciate that. PewDiePie wants to win a box of 2019 Donruss. Yep, Donruss is pretty nice. I probably will do another box of that again sometime this month. A lot of people do seem to like Don Russ. So let me just um, put this back in there. All right. Next one. Make sure you turn that down, Libby. She's watching on TV. This next one is from David Louie. David Louie. Um, the break for t um, the next week, will that be on eBay? Yeah, it'll be listed sometime on Patreon tomorrow first, and then I'll... Put the links for everybody else to uh, check out but i'm probably just going to um do just that one case because i don't want to do a really long case break next week i want to try to make this next case break a little bit shorter mandy says do you have any rizzo autographs i don't think i do i do have rizzo cards but no autographs just checking this out if we have uh any addresses there and it looks like we do not and the cards we got are some 1989 Tops Big. These are um, some Hall of Famers from that set, 89 Tops Big, at least a couple Hall of Famers on the top. I used to buy these when I was a kid. Then we have a Pirates Team card, a Pokemon card for Olivia, and a Ronald Acuna Leaf card. That's pretty nice. And there's also an Index card in there. The Cubs are losing eight and eight to zero right now. Yeah, they're one and five, about to be one and six. All right says i am 17 years old i'm a huge fan of your channel i have a youtube channel called it's david louis i hope i said that right the one with 332 videos and 17 subscribers that is a lot of work hopefully you get some more subs uh right now it's david louis um is the channel it's all capital letters he hopes i'm doing well he's sending a 2017 leaf ronald Acuna jr rookie card and some 89 top so he's providing an index card um, for you and a card for Livia to sign, if possible. He wants your autograph on the Pokemon card. You want to sign that? Olivia's right here. Sign your autograph on there. You're a huge Mets and Mike Trout fan. Mike Trout's your personal collection. Um, so if I have any Mets cards, um, I could send them your way. I definitely have Trout and Mets cards. So thank you very much, David. He's got a Bible verse down there, John 3.16. Very, very nice. For God so loved the world that he sent his only forgotten son. Thank you very much, David. Only begotten son. I think I messed that one up. Box Break Nation, how's it going? One more pack is then we're getting to these big, big boxes. There's a $10 super chat from Wicked Discounts. Wicked Discounts. Olivia signed that card for you. Very nice. Put that back in your envelope so when I... Respond, I'll send that your way. 
only begotten son. I messed that up with Patrick. Um, Wicked Discount says, Eric, thanks for the support. We need to get to 1,000 to be able to go live with the new rules. Can I get a shout out? Yep, shout out to you, Wicked Discount. Everyone sub to Wicked. He's a fellow um, Westmoreland County Vanian or whatever you want to call it. He lives really close to me, actually. And uh, he does YouTube video where, videos where he auctions off cards and um, does raffles for cards and uh, stuff like that. So check him out. Thank you very much for that $10 super chat. Next up, we have one more package. And I'm going to get these giant boxes, um, which basically these boxes take up my entire island here. You can see them right there. They're just literally huge. And they each weigh like um 33 pounds check that out 33 pounds all right uh wicked i don't i'm not going to any games this weekend i don't do day games so have fun down at pnc park um day games are pretty bad for batting practice they usually don't do it so i won't see you there i only usually do night games especially this season i'm cutting back a little bit on the day games all right this is well packaged let me get this opened up Clayton says, what are you, not making as many ball hawking videos as the season progresses? I made one so far. I've been to four games. I've probably snagged like 30 or 40 baseballs. I haven't really counted them up yet. Um, I'll get around to it. Um, just, you know, Throwback Thursday is kind of a staple, so I want to do that. And we always do a Fan Mail Friday. Tomorrow might be a subscription Saturday. We have a $10 super chat from D Porter. Says, hey, Eric, just stopping by to wish you in the chat a happy weekend. Thank you very much, D Porter. Really appreciate that $10 super chat. Everyone make sure you sub to D Porter along with Wicked. Those two $10 um, super chats you see on your screen at the top. Give them some subs. And a $50 super chat from William Schneider. Thank you very much, William. It says, glad to see the opening tonight live. William is probably one of the top donators, if not the top super chat donator. Really appreciate that, William. Um, that's awesome. Everyone make sure you sub to William. Click on that $49.99. It's probably going to be there for the rest of the uh, live stream because the more you donate in Super Chat, the longer it stays up. So as people come in, I'll have to keep pointing that out. Make sure that you sub $50 Super Chat. Thank you very much. Olivia just passed this to me. Hey. What do you want to say, Olivia? This is the last panel Friday of Pokemon cards. Okay. $2 Super Chat from 357 MAGA is Micah in next week's break. Um, usually what, Micah sent me $15 out of the blue and wants to be in a break. And um, saving a, I'm going to find a spot for him. I don't know. I guess I, I can maybe find a spot for him next week. Um, Gypsy Queen just sold out so fast that... Uh, eBay name is jabs underscore. Well, we got another $50 super chat from William again. William doubling down on the super chats. William, thank you so much. Two $50 super chats. William, thank you so much, man. Where are you from, William? Next time I'm out your way for a, um, for a ball game or something, we're gonna have to meet up and go out to a card shop or something. I could buy you some cards. That is really, really nice. 100 bucks. William is definitely a man. Make sure you sub to William if you haven't already. Chicago area, I will be out there. Um, I don't know when, but probably at the latest, um, late July, maybe for the national. So, William, I'll have to stay in touch with you. Thank you so much. i got to meet up with you, buy you some cards um, or something like that at the National. Hang out at the National for a little bit. That's awesome. This is from Shane, and we're going to check this out. Pirates shut out the Reds again. So, the Reds fall to 1-6, and six, and Pirates improved to 3-3. Three and three. That's awesome. Um, Pirates are rebounding. They should actually be like, I don't know, 5-0 and oh right now, 6-0. and oh. They've had to lead in every game. We've got some nice cards here from Shane. Alex Rodriguez, Starling Marte. Starling Marte is pretty awesome. I'd have to say he's my favorite pirate right now. He started pointing at me and um, giving me like a fist pump uh, yesterday. He saw me getting a ball off the track. 
Bobby Bo, rookie card, 87 Donruss. I'll also do 87 Donruss one of these days for a throwback Thursday. Some 81 Donruss cards. Eddie Murray, Dennis Eckersley had some bad luck with these. Collectibles, have you gotten a package from? No, I haven't been to the post office for the last three or four days um, just because um, I've been going to ball games every night. So I'll probably go tomorrow. I'm going to work on sending the breaks out tomorrow. Carrie Wood, that's a nice one. I have not received a box from Noah that I know of. It's probably sitting at the post office right now. Check out this one. Goose Gossage autograph card. That is really nice. And Kerry Wood bat relic. Maybe that's a bat that he shattered. And then we have a Melky Cabrera. Filmington's in here. I just watched his video, um, kind of a preview for the Rookie Card Explosion box, volume four. Um, it's probably actually sitting in my post office right now. I just haven't been there in days. Roberto Alomar. It's a nice patch there. Some Hall of Famers. We got a Andy Van Slyke, 84 Fleer rookie card. And then this is a good one, Frankie Montas. I just picked this guy up off the waiver wire in my fantasy league. He's getting a start tomorrow. So um, like that one a lot. Shout out to you, iPhone Joe. iPhone Joe's a legend around these chats. He looks up prices all the time. Hideki Matsui was a really good ball player. That's the first package. Mandy, I still have not made an Instagram um, I should get around to that because I, I could be posting stuff from the ballpark all the time. We have a $25 Super Chat from Trading Troy's channel. Thank you very much, Trading Troy. Everyone, take a second. Click on that $25 Trading Troy Super Chat and uh, click go to channel and uh, click subscribe. Give him a sub. Check out his channel. And while you're at it, also check out those two fifty dollars Super Chats from William Schneider if you haven't already and sub to him. Uh, you guys are really, really generous tonight. I'm doing a live stream tonight because I um, want to have some time after we're done with this. And a $10 super chat from William. Thank you so much. That's Bill Seitz. Bill Seitz. I don't know why I said William there. I think I was, just saw your name in the, the um, um, break is William Seitz. Bill Seitz with a uh, $10 super chat. Bill is a um, staple around here. Thank you so much, Bill. Really appreciate that. Uh, $10 Super Chat. Everyone sub to Bill, sub to Trading Troy, sub to William uh, Schneider. You guys, very, very generous. Um, Cameron's Super Chat record going to be calling it tonight. I think the all-time record for Super Chat was like 286 a long time ago. It was, actually might have been like the first or second time I started accepting Super Chats. 1984 Fleer is a nice set. I need to do one of these box breaks for Throwback Thursday. Um, but I don't want to do too many Fleers um, too often in a row. I think I did Fleer 83 and then Fleer 87. So I don't know what I'm doing next Throwback Thursday yet, but probably not Fleer. Uh, uh, Brennan says, Jabs, how much uh, would I have to pay for your, all of the 83 Tops rookie cards? It depends if you want them graded or in what condition. You could probably get all of them for like, I don't know, Sandberg, Boggs, Gwynn, 20 bucks raw, probably, maybe a little bit less, depending on the condition. There's the uh, infamous Alex Madrid. Um, this is the last package before these giant boxes. We have these huge, huge boxes here. Um, looking forward to these. There's a $2 super chat from A Mess of Things saying it's a super chat party. Thank you very much, A Mess of Things. Everyone, check out A Mess of Things channel. Click sub, and while you're at it, all those other colors on your screen, those ovals, click all those ovals and sub to all those guys that have super chatted. Um, thank you very, very much. Trout the Beast, there's Micah. All right, we also have a Nolan Ryan card here. It's a nice-looking Nolan Ryan Tops Gallery card. Let's check out this note from Shane. I went through all his cards first. All right, it says, what's up, um... What's up, Eric? Um, Shane Shane here, big Dodger fan. I actually bleed blue. Anyway, great job on your channel. You actually got me back into collecting. I originally started collecting in 82. Stopped around 95, went to college, got married to some crazy women. Don't do it, guys. It takes years off your life. Well, back to earth. I got divorced, and now I'm actually being supportive um, on collecting by my pops. And we have a 1999 Super Chat from Fire Sports Cards. It's like a whole rainbow of colors up there. Thank you very much. Fire Sports Cards. Everyone, click on that 1999 from Fire Sports Cards and sub to him. Just click go to channel. Give him a sub. 
Um, my wife's over there watching the chat. Make sure that you sub to everyone that super chats over there. Um, thank you very much. We've got a bunch of colors. Um, you guys are really, really generous tonight. Thank you so much. Uh, so it says, your pops is supporting you, or you're, well, I lost my spot. Who I take care of now. He's a Vietnam vet. Respect is big around him. Thanks to all who serve. So I sent you a package. Some I think you will like. Some pirates, some players I don't care for. So just give them away. Um, as spoke noisemakers. There's a $2 super chat from Major League Hats. Thank you very much, Major League Hats. I'm everyone sub to Major League Hats channel. That's kind of an interesting thing, Major League Hats. Um, lots of different genres of baseball stuff you can find. Baseball cards, baseball collectors, uh, autograph collectors, baseball hats. Pretty cool. Goes on to say, um, um, I am a Patreon sub of yours and still waiting on a package, but I know you're a busy school teacher. Well, I said enough. Catch you on your next vid. Um, thank you very much, Shane. Patreon package. I got 155 of those to send out. I'll be working on those also. Um, can't wait for Easter break so I can start to get caught up on some of the stuff. I have 380 packages waiting to be shipped from eBay. Um, since the season started, my eBay's been blowing up. Like People keep buying wax packs off of me and everything. So It's been really, really, really super, super busy. Thank you very much, Shane, for those cards. Now, the last thing I have is all of these giant boxes. And we have a $1.99 super chat from the Aranya boys. Uh, check out the Aranya boys, and he's reminding you that Wicked Discounts needs to get to 1,000 subs um, so he can start making some money. Uh, so check out um, Wicked Discounts. Thank you very much, Aranya boys, for the super chat and the shout-out for um, Wicked. So here we go. These giant, giant, giant boxes. Um, these things are huge. Uh, like I showed you before, they all weigh um, at least 30 pounds or so on average. Um, I got an email from Don. Don is the person that sent these. He sent six of these, and he said it's going to be a surprise, and he said that it could be for a Throwback Thursday, or we could do a box break for it, um, and uh, maybe... We, speaking of box breaks, we have a five dollar super chat from Box Break Nation. It says combo break, guys. Check it out. Thanks, Jabs. Everyone, check out Box Break Nation. Thank you very much for that five dollar super chat, and uh, check out his channel for a nice mixer break there. All right. So how am I going to do this? These things are so huge. Um, I guess we'll just start pulling them, pulling them down one by one. And uh, open them up. I'm gonna have to probably, um, Livy. I should probably be the one to do this. I'm gonna have to move the tripod up on a big box, and um, hopefully I can figure this out without knocking a bunch of stuff over. All right, here we go. Uh, Don said he didn't mind if his address was showing because it's just a PO box. Let's see what we have in here. What do you guys think's in here? Like 100,000 cards? No. I think he said something about breaks, so I'm thinking it might be boxes, sets, wax boxes. I think there's Brad some. Pitt. Brad Pitt. I think there might be some jelly beans in Some jelly beans? Yeah, it's a Easter. Oh, this, I tell you what this looks like. This looks like a rack pack box. No. You know rack packs? Yeah, it is rock. Whoa! I must lost it. I do not want people to, I don't know, get, I probably scare them worse by screaming. Sorry. You just scared your whole, your whole Sorry for scaring everybody. What Struggling with opening these. All right, we have a rack pack case, a full case of rack packs. Rack packs are those, um, those clear cellophane packs with three um, compartments in them, like three little packs of cards. Uh, and Libby is um, putting that in the way for some reason. Wow, we have a 1990 Tops Rack Pack case. That would be fun to open. Looking for the Frank Thomas no name on front. Check it out. That is awesome. I don't know how much these go for. I. I a case of 90 tops, just like 36 
packs, um, 20 bucks in the case. I think that usually goes for like 150 or 200. So I'm guessing that this might go for, I don't know, anywhere up to $100 or so. That is really, really nice. Thank you very much, Dawn. That's awesome. Frank Thomas, no name on front. It's a really super, super tough card to find. And um, if we tear through a bunch of rack packs, maybe we'll find it. That would be a fun break to do. Um, that's the first one. I'm not sure if these are all 1990 tops. Um, there's, a, there's, they're all different sizes. I think they're slightly different. Like, so we got a 90 tops rack pack box. There's three boxes of 24 rack packs in there. That makes a grand total of 72 rack packs. And now we're doing the next box. This is probably another case. Not sure what it is. Don did a really nice job packaging these up. So I'm going to try not to knock the camera over again when I do this. I'm sorry that I can't really read um, what you're saying right now because I'm kind of off to the side opening these up. Looks like this is a different uh, case. See, it has blue ink. The last one had purple ink. I'm thinking it might be another rack pack box, which is, or, or actually not box, it's a whole case. Let's check it out. It is another rack pack case. What year do you think this is? Rack pack. I used to like rack packs. Every Rack Pack card usually would have a... Oh, I see a color on the screen. Let me move over here. There's a $5 Super Chat from Frank Burke. Frank Burke with a $5 Super Chat. Thank you very much. <coughs> it says, just a note, sign up to be a Patreon patron today. Thank you very much, Frank. I really appreciate that. Everyone sub to Frank. And I appreciate your support. And there we go. There's our next giant box. Um, I don't know. What, what year do you think this is from? You, what? It's from Jelly Bean? That doesn't even make yeah, any sense. He's the Let's jelly. bust it open and see. Hopefully I don't rip off my fingernails. Sometimes I... 89? Yep, you called it. 89. Nice call. Spencer Sports Cards. 1989 Tops Rack Packs. We did a box of these for Throwback Thursday back when the series was first starting up a few months ago. Um, the best cards out of 89 Tops. Randy Johnson, Craig Biggio, John Smoltz. Um, Gary Sheffield rookie cards, and there are also um, these all-star cards in each one. And Tallboy got his Yaz autograph today in the mail. You re might remember that uh, the best card we pulled out of our Heritage break from two weeks ago was a Carl Yastrzemski on-card autograph. And my wife is pointing. We have a $2 Super Chat from a mess of things. It says, do a huge break and smash your brother's record. Um... Maybe one of these days I will do that, a giant um, six-hour long break. My brother does have the record for the longest ever break on YouTube, at least that I know of. It is a five-hour and 49-minute break. The longest I've ever gone was a little bit over four hours. And um, literally, it, it take, the thing about a long break like that, it takes forever to sort the cards out. Like, I just got done sorting all the Gypsy Queen cards, and now I have to ship 380 packages. So... I don't know. I'll probably do that um, at some point, maybe when I have some time off in the summer um, because it just does take so long. All right, here's our next case. Dawn, thank you very much for all of these um, cases. This is really, really awesome of you. Uh, 83 Tops Rookies. I would say about, I mean, I'm not selling my 83 Tops Rookies because a lot of them people sent to me, but... I would just say go on eBay and go to sold listings. You could probably get all of them for around 20 bucks or so. I'm sure someone has that on there. Like the 83 tops, Lot, um, Gwyn, Sandberg, Boggs. All right, here's our next one. This looks like it might be another 89 tops. If I can get it open. Same colors, and yes, it's another 89 tops. We should do these for a. Um, we should do these for a nice uh, vintage box break. And since the cards were sent to me for free, we could like, you know, not like I wouldn't have to obviously charge that much for it because I got all these cards for free. Like if I was buying these cases out in the wild, I know they would probably be around fifty dollars a case. At the very least, like 89 tops would probably be about 50 bucks for a case of these or so. 90 tops would be probably a little more than that. That's two super chats. And we got two super chats, my wife tells me. Let me check it out. <clears throat> what do we got here? 
Um, it says, Joe iPhone Services. Thanks for helping and supporting the card crew. You're welcome, Joe iPhone. Everyone check out Joe iPhone. And $5 Super Chat from Back in the Game Collecting. It says, just saying sup. Um, thank you very much for that $5 Super Chat. Everyone make sure you sub to Joe iPhone. And also click that $5 and click go to channel and back in the game collecting. And while you're there, William Schneider's $50 Super Chats are still there for you guys. If you're just getting in now, um, there's about 400 of you watching live. Uh, William really killed it with $100 of donations. So to thank him, the least we can all do is sub to him. That's very, very generous of you. Um, that'll basically pay for a trip to Washington, D.C. if I wanted to go down there and see the Buckos next weekend. I'm not sure if I'm going to do that because they're day games. But that money will go back into the channel. Traveling somewhere. Is there a website I, that I can use to get cheap cases? Will, uh, will, I would say just shop around. Blowout cards, Steel City Collectibles are good ones. David Adams, they all sell cases. Diamond cards, um, who else have I used? Sometimes I actually on eBay I find ch uh, cheap cases. Sometimes they have best offers and I'll just uh, put an offer in and actually some of the cases that I've broken down my breaks I've actually just gotten off of eBay. All right, here's our next case. What do you guys think this one is? A jelly bean. Uh, just looking at it, it's a it's another rack pack box. Looking through there, it has kind of the old design. Um, 87 tops had this same box, 86 tops. We have a $2 super chat from Dominic and Noah Productions. It says, I'm feeling sick. I got PAX fever. Thank you very much, Dominic and Noah. Everyone check them out. We're seeing 88 and 86. Wicked discounts with another $5 donation. Um, he says, working on... Thousand subs, thanks so much. I got a jelly bean. Make sure that you sub to Wicked. He's only probably about 300 away from a thousand, so you can start making some money. So I saw 86 was a prediction for this. Uh, 88, 52 tops. I wish um, it's not clear. It's definitely tops. Yeah, 88 rack pack boxes also had this kind of design. All right, here we go. Let's see who is right. A couple different predictions. And it is 1986. That's pretty awesome. 86 tops. Getting a little bit older here. 1986 tops. I mean, I, I really like the design. Um, not a lot of good rookie cards in there unless you, uh, you love Cecil Fielder or Harold Renner, Reynolds or Ozzie Guillen. Um, the good rookie cards are an 86 tops update. But um, that's really awesome. A lot of people like 86 tops. And um, that is really, really, really nice. Thank you so much, Don. Absolutely, you're just super generous. Um, really, really awesome. So that's our fourth of the six boxes. We've got two more boxes to show you, and then we'll get on out of here. I told you it'd be a short fan mail Friday. I'll have to figure out what to do with all these cases. I'll have to do some kind of break. We got 86 tops rack packs. We got 89 tops racks. We got 90 tops racks. This next one, by the way, this is all possible because of Dawn, so make sure uh, we don't forget Dawn is the man for doing this. Dawn, his name's Dawn Barry from California. I'm going to come over here to the other side. Get this yeah, open. Eat some more jelly beans I'm eating jelly beans. What's that? Next, next case break is going to be Diamond Kings, and we're going to be doing it on... Um, Probably next Wednesday, I'm going to try to do it on break day or release day. Um, I'm getting it straight from the distributor, so it's going to be shipped right to me. So I hope it's here. If it's not here on the release day, then it'll be the next day. But Diamond Kings 2019 will be the next one. All right, let's see what we have here. Got to get this protective wrapping off. This, what's this called? Craft paper, I think it's called. We have a black um, ink case. What year do you guys think this is? It's not 89, 89 was blue, 90 was purple. It's not 88, I'm guessing it's um, 87, I wanna say. Mike G says 87, let's see if we're right. Let me zoom in there a little bit. <coughs> All right, Topps Chewing Gum, I wonder if they, do they still operate out of Duryea? Der I don't even know how you say that. I think that's over by Philadelphia. It's another one of these older cases. And my dog is 
So let's see what it is. I'm thinking it's 87 because I was looking at a case of 87 at the flea market and I didn't pull the trigger on, on it. It is 88. One year off, 88 tops. Maybe find a Tom Glavin rookie card in there. Um, I always like, these tops rack, rack packs are pretty cool. I don't know why my dog is howling still. But uh, this is a ton, a ton of cards and they have these all-star cards in there. There's a $5 super chat from Box Break Nation. It says, we'll select one subscriber from tonight for a free Cal Ripken Jr. 150th year patch. So all you have to do is subscribe to Box Break Nation and you will be in the running along with the other new subscribers for a Cal Ripken patch. That's a pretty good deal. All right, one more box. Uh, and then, I don't know, I might talk to my brother about doing something with these too because he is like um, really, really into vintage cards also. Okay, I'm gonna need I'm gonna need those scissors. So let's not play with those All right, here we go last one. This is a giant case. This is the biggest one. I was using it to support the camera <coughs> Now I don't um, I don't know how I'm gonna do this No, nah, I think I can get it. There's staples in it though, so I, I don't want to drop the camera All right, I'm just going to um, Let you look at this for a minute and I'm gonna get this open and then I will show you. Of course, I opened it upside down. All right, here we go. This is our final case of the night. These are all from Don Barry out in California. Um, Keith says it's 88. Let's see. This one is going to be an older one. Someone said 87, I saw. I saw 86. It's a six box case. And the year for this one is. You called it 87 with a Bo Jackson rookie card on top. Check that one out. Very nice. Bo Jackson rookie card on top. Future star. Love that card. Probably find a bunch of Barry Bonds out of these cases. Wow. That is really, really awesome. Um, I, I bet you a pack with Bo Jackson on top would probably sell for, I don't know, 10 bucks maybe on eBay. That is really, really nice. Um so I think we saw another super chat there, and it is from Joe iPhone Services. Thank you very much, Joe. Everyone check out Joe's channel. He's getting up there in subs, too. I think he's almost at 700. Um, so Jason M. says, keep that Bo Jackson pack unopened. Uh, we're going to do something with these. Um, probably do a big, huge um, throwback Thursday break where you guys can all get into it for pretty cheap. Uh, the most expensive part of the break is going to be just shipping the cards to you. Because literally, there's probably at least, um, I don't know, what, what would you guys say? How many cards do you think are here? Um, in this box alone, there's probably at least, I would say at least 10,000 cards or so right here alone. So um, I'll think of something that'll be on the horizon. A Rack Pack Break sponsored by Dawn. Thank you very much, Dawn, for all these cases. Um, this was not inexpensive for you to send. I know that you probably spent at least 70 to 80 bucks to ship all these cases, if not more, um, not to mention the cost of the cases. So Don really appreciate, um, you sending all of these cases my way. And we have a super chat. Uh, how much was it? I missed it. Uh, $1 super chat from gaming rock man 12. Thank you very much. Um, gaming rock man 12 for that $1 super chat. Really appreciate that. And uh, that's it for Fan Mail Friday, everybody. We're going to do a big break with these at some point. I don't know when it's going to be, but just know that I have them, and it's going to be a multi-rack pack break from 86, 87, 88, 89, and 90 tops. Should be pretty fun. And, um, yeah, you guys can all get into it, hopefully. But that's it. Tomorrow, I think I'm going to do a subscription Saturday. I do believe I have a boom box waiting for me at the post office. I have to go pick that up tomorrow. And um, along with all the other mail that I haven't picked up this week, I'm not going to any more baseball games for a little while. So I also have some PNC Park video footage to put up from the past few days. Um, but that's it. So have a great night, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you to everyone that sent Super Chat donations. I really appreciate that. You guys are awesome. William's Super Chats are still on the screen. See those 49.99s? So make sure you click on those and give William a sub because that was super generous of him. And I really, really appreciate that. So with that, I hope you all have a great evening. 